Okay, first of all, let me say that the Silver Snail is the bomb. That's where I just was. And uh, I'm heading over to Teletoon right now. I've got a contest winner who I'm taking with me to go see a couple of episodes of the new season of Batman the Brave and the Bold. Got a fan. How's it going? Yeah, this is the guy. He's the contest winner. Come to see Batman cartoons. I'm so down. <laughs> yeah, are you excited? I'm excited. Are you a Batman fan from I'm the old Batman days? I'm a Batman fan from the old days. Oh, what's your favorite thing about Batman? Batman, the utility belt. Oh, nice. On a Batman. You're a Batman. On a Batman. On a Batman. I'm definitely scared to pull any crimes now. On a Batman. That's why. I hope the Teletune office is like that mad office from that episode of The Simpsons. As you know, a fan right here, follow him on Twitter. He, he's my contest winner. And so as the contest winner, he gets a comic book of Shazam. He's also got a comic, a comic book of Batman the Brave and the Bold, which is the comic book we're, the show we're here to see today. And then I've got uh, uh, a Batman action figure from the Justice League series. And last but not least, I've only got one of these to give away, so this is like the grand prize. He gets a Blamoid Series 3 collector minifigure of Batman. Awesome. Here you go. Now, I've got a few spares here. Like, for example, I've got uh, a, a couple of spare Batman action figures. Anybody into Batman? Okay, I've got first hand, second hand. Here you go. Oh, done. Here you go. I'm not the one who puts my hand up. That's right. And then is anybody not caught up on their comic book reading? Because I've got a bunch of Billy Bats and the Magic of Shazam. I've got a bunch of Batman the Brave and the Bold. There's the first one I saw. Here you go. I saw the second one. Where's the second hand? Here you go. And then who else did you compare? Here you go. And the round you go. <laughs> so the, sil the silver snail was the one who gave us these prizes. So who is prize winners can please just look over the camera and say thanks to the silver snail for donating the awesome prize. And to tell it to him for putting this little party together. My, my question is, why does this Batman? who is not marked as like special metal winged Batman, have metal wings. It's for a bonus, man. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Oh, like, I'm, just, I'm wondering if there's like a comic booky answer reason to this. Actually, if you also look on the back, the Flash has like this weirdo gun thing attached to his hands. I don't remember the Flash. Yeah, Batman. Flash, what are you doing? I don't know. I don't know this really new show very well, but like, Flash never had a gun when I was a kid. So that's why they gave him the And then there's Superman with that flower. Uh, Here's the thing, DC Comics. You got to let us know what's the scoop with this Batman having armored wings and why the Flash has a gun. Heather, are you enough of an enthusiast that you would know? I don't know why the Flash would have a gun. Do you know why Batman would have armored wings, but it wouldn't specify that it's a special kind of Batman? Yeah. Batman's kind of always a special kind of Batman, though, right? He always has what he needs. That's a good, he just that's happens that, to have it on him. That's an excellent point. I, I just told 40 dudes not to look and give horse in the mouth. He got bonus wings for the price of nothing. First time in Teletoon? Yes, it is. How are you feeling? It's cool. It's like the law of his breath. We need all of his logos. A fan is getting a private sneak peek tour of the screening room before the show. This is so awesome! <laughs> So we sit, we sit here in the front row. Mm. So That's when you come in, make sure that you come in the front row. And if you, row? Uh, for, for, and if you're the first one here out of me and the people that I know, just save all the seats. It's all ours. Yeah, save it all. Cool, huh? Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you guys were here and I was saying that for Halloween, we did. Oh, you're playing rock band. Rock band. Rock band <laughs> competition. <laughs> And Joker action figures. Yay! <laughs> All right. So let's find these Batman and Joker action figures. You know, I love, I love that Sean knows exactly where it's going. Oh, right on. Here they are. Oh, this is the shit. <laughs> That's badass. Break my heart. Man, you eating some candy, man? Oh yeah, leftover Halloween candy. Everybody loves them.
So what did you think of that cartoon? I loved it. Honestly, um, I haven't watched any of the new stuff because um, the Batman series that was released before this one right. was really disappointing. Well, this one is actually, I don't mind saying, this is actually the superhero cartoon that I want to see because I've always been talking this for years, at least a decade now, about why do all the cartoons, superhero cartoons on TV have that thin line, like that 90s X-Men look? Mm -hmm. like, we, why not bring back that, that thick line Powerpuff Girls style yeah, for these superhero cartoons and so this Batman one did it and uh, did it right and did it good. You gave, you gave, Agreed. Say? Hey a fan, did you ever win in one of these awards man? A couple of times. Yeah, well, what did you win it for? Um, best awesome. <laughs> best awesome? That's a good category. Yeah. I'll bet you also won an award for making up categories. <laughs> I, I did, that was my second one. Cavity. Did you get toys, man? Yeah, I did, man. Did you get them stash. toys, man? Oh, shit. Yo, I got them toys, man. Oh, yours are already and you open. notice, yeah, you'll notice that I'm a big enough geek that I, I, I couldn't stand it. I couldn't stand it. I had to open it up already. These will not next appear uh, on my desk at work. Shaw has a bad habit of opening his uh, his toys, but we uh, still have them in their carbon yeah, casing well, packaging. That's carbon almost casing. If that. you found out that it would make the value better to have a painting paint side at the wall, would you hide, hide the painting up so you can never look at it? No. For the same reason <laughs> is why the toys are worth more to me to have them out playing with them toys than hoping that one day they're going to be toys, worth uh, something, quote yes, unquote. Yes, but you can't polish your shit on it. No, but you can pose Batman's arms and make him punch things.